First and foremost, we give all glory and honor and praises to the Most High God, Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shot, Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father, who they only call God, and Jesus Christ, who they only call that, Yahweh Shot Hamashiach. You know what I'm saying? This is a little quick, little edifying. I uh, just want to talk a little bit about it. So it says in Revelation chapter 18 and verse 4, and it says, And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people. Is that literally talking about, oh, leave Babylon the great America? No, it's talking about come out of the ways that's, that we live in Babylon. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to touch on that too. And it says, I heard another voice from heaven saying, come out of her, my people. Because our people are stuck in the customs of Babylon, celebrating birthdays, celebrating um, pagan holidays, um, uh, um, not even keeping the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High God. It says that ye be not partakers of her sins and that ye receive not of her plagues. For her sins have reached us to heaven and God, Yahweh, re have remembered her iniquities. You know what I'm saying? Let's keep going. And it says reward her even as she rewarded you and double unto her according to her works in the cup which she have filled to her double. You know what I'm saying? This place is soon to be destroyed by who they call on uh, Jesus Christ, Yahweh Shahamashiach. You know what I'm saying? He just wants his people to come out. You know what I'm saying? Because he uh, spoke about a prophet on uh, Jeremiah. You know what I'm saying? Let's uh, go see what the Lord told the prophet. You know, the prophet Jeremiah, chapter 10, verse 1, it says, Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Because let's go, because it might be some new people, because. Some people might not know the Lord's only been dealing with um, black, Hispanic, and Native Americans. It says, Amos 3 and 1, Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family with, which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, because the Lord, he tastes good. He, he, you know what I'm saying? That's all glory and honor to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. You know what I'm saying? That's very important to the Lord that he took us from Egypt. You know what I'm saying? It says, you only have I known of all the families of the earth. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. So for this is for one on um, you parents that's out there. You know what I'm saying? Like, OK, if your kid is acting up at the school, you ain't coming for nobody else, child, but yours. Because you expect better out yours. So that's how the most High God is expecting it out of us. I know you. You my child. I expect better out of you. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't suspect you to be like them because I know I raised you different. That's how the most I, I chose you. I gave you these law such commandments. I don't know Ling Ling. I don't know Becky. I don't know none of them. You got to guess what? We got to come out the ways of Babylon. So let's go back to the prophet Jeremiah. Jeremiah 10 and 1, it says, Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. He's only been talking to black people, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Thus said the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen. Don't learn the way of celebrating your birthday. Learn not the way of keeping Christmas. Learn not the way of keeping all these pagan holidays. Our people are the, the first ones to go pop fireworks on July 4th. In 1776, when we was enslaved in America, our people loved to celebrate New Year's when we were still in slavery. Why, 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 why is it so hard to stop doing these things? That's right, because your lying Christian pastor, pork chop eating, sellout pastor, wants to keep preaching you bull crap. These pastors ain't nothing but robbers, gangsters, and liars and thieves. They lie to the people all the time. Then when the real true prophets of the Lord come out of highway, byway, y'all be ready to fight. Y'all be ready to cuss. But you won't do that to your lying pastor. That's why we tell people all the time, humble down and come hear the words of the Lord. It says, thus said the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven for the heathen are dismayed at them why because they know their kingdom coming to an end they know that guess what a black man is going to come crack that sky if it come save only his people so guess what come out of babylon come out of her come out of this system that we live in and come back to the true 
God of the heaven and earth, Yahweh and his son, Yahweh Shai. And let me get this last close of precept and um, revelation. And it's all praise to the Lord, man. Okay, next chapter. Uh, let's see. Yeah, next chapter. Yeah, right here. Revelation 14 and 12, it says, Here's the patience of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of God, Yahweh, and the faith of Jesus, who they call that, Yahweh Shai. You know what I'm saying? So in these last days, make sure that you always keep in the commandments and always the faith in who they call Jesus Christ, Yahweh Shai HaMashiach. We're giving our glory and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai. Call me Asherah.